Hundreds of people were in downtown Cedar Rapids today for the 31st CR Pride Festival. KCRG TV9's Molly Swain was there today and shares what the annual celebration means to the many in attendance. And I feel like I can be me and express myself safely here. According to 15-year-old Julianne Swiftbird, Pride has the power to give people permission to walk through the world exactly the way they want to. It shows people who might not be out yet or might not be in a place where they're comfortable that they do have a place and they do have a community. Those I spoke to said demonstrations of love and acceptance were especially important this year. It feels like the government's trying to erase us almost. To show up here today shows that we are here, we are loud, we are proud, and we won't stop showing up for this. There have been a lot of attacks on our community this year. Drew Powell with CR Pride mentioned book bans that have, in practice, targeted some LGBTQ stories, as well as a recent U.S. Supreme Court decision that ruled in favor of a Colorado graphic designer who does not want to create websites for same-sex weddings. It's good to have that support to know at least here locally we are supported, and there are a lot of people in our corner who are here to support us. Three hugs over here. The support looked like this. Hundreds of people in a crowd where everyone was encouraged to be their own individual. It's just saying, hey, like we're finally to a place where we can come together and we can all be equal and coexist. In Cedar Rapids, Molly Swain, KCRG, TV9 News.